Another dry, dry, hazy day here in Central California. A little bit of cloud cover sneaking into our region because we have this low pressure system out near the Pacific Center and that cloud cover. And it looks like it'll send it a little bit of rain once we get to about late in the day, Wednesday into Wednesday night here. So still another dry, hazy day tomorrow. And we're going to see some clouds in addition. And that might actually impact your viewing of the super moon tonight. So here's Futurecast to show you what's going to go on. There's that ridge that's been keeping us mild and dry for quite some time. The system starts to approach from the coast of uh, northern California here. Unfortunately, since this is out in the middle of the Pacific, it is a warm storm. Snow levels are going to be fairly high, above 8 thousand feet and rainfall amounts probably light because most of the energy is going to go to northern California probably between a quarter to maybe a quarter of an inch of rain uh, at the most in some parts of the valley mainly in the foothills but overall it is something and hopefully this is the one that swings the door open to an active weather pattern as we move forward into the month of January and 2018 here and then it's a quick moving system we'll be out of here once we get to about uh, Thursday morning or so so December was very disappointing we only picked up four one hundredth of an inch of rain and that will likely place this as the fifth driest December on record of course the driest Decembers were 2011 and 1989 where no measurable rain was recorded at all in Fresno and of course both those years were drought years. Tonight, it's starting to cool off out there. We're in the 50s for most of the valley. 55 in Lemoore, 56 in Fresno, 55 for Merced, and 53 for Porterville. Compared to 24 hours ago, most of the valley is a little bit cooler compared to this time yesterday. Others are a little bit warmer, but for uh, day by day, as we move forward here into the rest of the week here, we're going to gradually warm up to the upper 60s throughout most of the valley, very mild for January. And, of course, it is hazy out there, impacting visibility, mainly Fresno County southwards, about 3 to 4 miles. Uh, North Valley visibility, not too bad tonight. So we tied record highs today in Merced, Madera, and Hanford. Fresno was well below the record high. Uh, we only hit 63 degrees this afternoon, and the average is 53 for this time of year. Fresno's record 69 set back in 1997 and our overnight lows pretty much on track low to mid 30s throughout most of the valley so early on in the morning it feels like winter but in the afternoon it kind of feels like early fall here in central california unhealthy air quality for everyone tomorrow in all valley counties also wood burning prohibited valley wide you're not allowed to use your fireplace at all that is for tomorrow for tonight though it's just for fresno kings and tulare county but tomorrow it is valley wide cloudy and hazy in the foothills in the sierra with temperatures in the 60s even the 70s in some parts of the sierra and of course tonight in the valley overnight lows will be in the upper 30s to low 40s so a chilly evening ahead of us and tomorrow pretty much the same deal we're going to be in the 60s as a matter of fact we're going to be a little bit warmer. 66 in Fresno Clovis and the extended forecast shows those showers very late in the day on Wednesday into Wednesday night, Thursday morning. Then we're still talking about maybe another system coming in Friday into Saturday here and we'll cool off a little bit. But overall, hopefully we're going to see some decent showers once we get to the middle of the week here in the valley. Okay, that sounds good. We're ready for some rain, Ruben. Yeah, it's long overdue. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you got it. Thanks. Thanks.